Ladies and gentlemen, we are headed to Arrakis for this latest Forex title from Shiro Games. Don Hayes is the name, and June Spice Wars is the game. The guild informs me that your troops have safely arrived in orbit over Arrakis. The Sardaukar are ready to disembark. The conquest of Arrakis will begin on your command, Majesty. Your enemies aren't expecting your arrival, but they will react to it with violence. No Emperor has ever decided to harvest the planet himself. The resistance of the Landsrad houses will be just as ferocious as that of the locals. Ah, so we've got House Furnius of Ix and Harkonnen. Interesting. Well, I actually think... Um, House Carino is very good against Ix specifically because of their ability to forward drop command centers. Alright, let's have a look at the options. So you've got bonus spice. Three authority per village controlled by another faction after every council. Wow, that is huge. Specifically huge for Carino. I like that. That's probably what we're going to end up doing. And that's just hegemony victory, which is nice and easy. Yeah, this has got to be the one we go for. What was the strategic benefit of this one? Okay, that's pretty good too. No, I'm going to go with this one. I just love this three authority per village controlled by another faction after every council. Wow. Amazing. So... In every village, a single building can be structured more than one time and can have two more crew and harvesters. Huge, especially as this is a spice planet, uh, spice region. Uh, I'm gonna go with military units have more power in, in truce. All right, let's do this. This territory is equally rich in manpower and resources. Occupying these villages should stabilize our supply lines in the continuing conquest of Arrakis. This was a wise choice on your part. Alrighty, so it's worth noting that I probably put about over a hundred hours into uh, June Spice Wars at this point. Um, so I'm probably going to be running through this uh, campaign relatively quickly. Um, but I'll try and highlight all the things that I think are relevant um, as we do it. Um, a lot of my decision making, um, especially when there's downtime like now, obviously, where we're just sort of setting out. Um, so it looks like we've got uh, Spice Space here, which is perfect for us to capture straight off the bat. I um, want to try and get nice and close to this guy. Splashes both. Uh, the uh, ranged militia and the, uh, the swordsman. Um, so this is hegemony 15k, which is actually quite a low amount of hegemony. Um, especially with multiplayer missions being around about 25k mark. Uh, which suggests that this is quite a either small to medium sized map. And it sure looks like it from that. Um, just from zooming out, it looks like it's a sort of medium-sized map. So we want to try and capture base as quick as possible. Yes. We do have the added challenge with Carino in that the further we are from... Awaiting order. Uh, the further the villages are from our main base, the cost goes up exponentially in terms of the authority cost to capture it. So these types of missions are made that much more difficult because of House Carino's um, quirk, I guess. Okay, one manpower, one building of each type. Should start with solid materials plus 15 plus reproduction. Uh, I'm going to go Megalopolis, survival training. I'm going into 
integrated costs, I think. Or advanced engineering, even. After that. So we already nuked all of our manpower. Time to build our first refinery. That's a fast creep base. We should capture that. Oh, it's just two ranged militia. Nice. We are listening, Majesty. Should be very easy to cap. On watch. Got some money that we can pick up. Listening. Try and get loads of ornithopters Flamers just to scout moving. out the yes, area. Moving. Just grab yes, spice. Wow, 99 already. Just go the distance from base. Oof. As that's what I mean by the challenge of Carino. Like, that's only what? Two regions away from my main base, and it's already costing me almost 100 authority to capture. So plus creep base. The benefit with Carino, however, is that you can build two a lot of buildings you can build twice. Which is amazing with Solari and Plus Creep bases. Um even in the fuel cells actually to a degree. Oh, it's a spice base. Yeah, that's definitely worth picking up as soon as we can. Let's go to work. Awaiting order. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna link up a ornithopter to make that safe. Got another one for scouting purposes. This is like a no man's land, interestingly. Okay, we're going to go into manpower production straight off the bat just because we want more incinerators but they cost 50 manpower. Um, now in my opinion and what I've tested, swordsmen are basically the early game tank replaced by the Sardaukar in the late game. Followed by incinerators are your main bulk of your troops because their DPS is quite good. Um, the Conscript Riflemen are okay. I'd say that they are more specialists in taking down air units. And whilst it's good to mix maybe one or two units into your army, I'd say incinerators just far out trade um, what riflemen can do, certainly from a DPS perspective. The other benefit of um, incinerators is that they're... Um, their attacks do AoE and they basically pierce enemies so they can attack multiple units at once. Okay, that's yes, definitely worth Majesty. picking up. Just grab the gold. Just grab the re manpower. More ornithopters. We are running a little bit low on the old cash. Which could be a problem. It's even that's 124. The only problem with recruitment officers is the fact that they cost 20 Solari to maintain, which is a heavy, heavy Majesty. cost. Okay, there's also money there to be had. Oh, this is a spice base. We should definitely be grabbing this. We are listening, Next, then. First thing we want to do is just make sure we got good money coming in. It's 
focus a little bit more on money than spice. Reporting for duty. You want to be get putting some crew on there as well, but so again, it's a heavy cost early on. Forty. We are ready. Oh, I'm gonna lose a troop already. We're here to clean up the mess. We'll Come on, you can do it. Reporting you can duty. make it. We are ready. Oh, we did as well. Nice. Although, uh, sandworm that early on does not bode well. Clearly, sandworms are very present on this mission. I think we need to start getting just wholesale markets, even just to get some more income. Flamers reporting. Yeah, money is going to be a bit of a challenge. I can be a reliable ally. It's got a bit of money. That could be worth picking up. I think we'll get one more flamer unit. I'll grab this. Let's see what the land stride can do for us. Do want another incinerator. Okay, we can put 10 points in that. We don't have any um, special regions. If we put maybe 90 points in this. Looks like a lot of people have a lot of influence, so... Oh, we did get that. And we got the 10, so we're actually only 10 points away from the next um, Landstrad standing. Oh, that's not good, though. So they we've been targeted by... The minor houses, Vernius and Harkonnen. Wow. That's not ideal. That's going to cost us money we don't have. My support is not free. Just need money right now. We are ready. So each land stride is about twenty-eight days. So twenty-eight days of uh, let's get to business. Lower income is going to be painful. Um, yeah, I can use that influence to get more money. moving resources around so you get I mean that, that worked for me basically back to where we started but I've got extra money so <laughs> what's not to like um, I think I need to put more crew in there hopefully we're ready to capture this base now we've got enough authority he's hoping no uh Spice worms come and attack us. In fact, we should probably split the troops up a little bit just in case. Coordinating the attack. We're here to clean up the mess. Up 
Operation Scorched Earth in progress. We're moving. They'll burn. Your Majesty? Always mindful of sandworms. They're the one thing that can ruin your day. It doesn't matter how much time you've put into the game, you're still, uh, you can still be a victim of a sandworm attack. <laughs> yes, Majesty. And you can split your troops up if it does happen, even just to mitigate some of the damages, but even then it's still, uh, still painful. So you want to get the, uh, one of the conscripts in range to stop these guys. We should probably grab this, 30% extra damage, and then you give allied units plus one armor. Uh, we should go integrated cost, riches of Arrakis, and then administrative con. whatever that is. We serve the Imperium. Okay, nice. Grab this base. I'm just going to put... Uh, there's clearly a seat somewhere in this area. So they've already launched one attack, so I don't want to have to keep pulling my army back every time they launch an attack against me. So let's get enough troops that I don't have to worry about that. And this was the base that they targeted last time, so... Always guaranteed that's the base they'll always attack. So not doing too badly. Okay, we should get some authority production. I want to try and go for 30 slurry production because it's huge. Um, we also need another refinery. We should get a scavenged ornithopter, so let's just... Reporting for duty. It's gonna take ages for anyone to come back. Um Alright, we'll hold fire on that one. There's another scavenged ornithopter there. Uh, right on cue, we've already got a army ready for them. Right, this would be a good base for us to take actually, 150 cost. Uh, that would be a good base. Wow, oh, we're already... F the two influence actually would be good. We haven't got much money. Yes, Majesty. It's going to be quite expensive. Okay, we need money. Um, I feel like spice is the we next. It's always a thing to get. Three discoveries outside of our land. We are listening, Majesty. Okay, so you grab that. Oh, we might even lose this. Oh. That would be surprising if three units can't take out one. It's very likely at this point. At your service, your majesty. Listening, majesty. Flamers reporting. Just grab a swordsman. Flamethrowers are filled up. We'll make it go away. Okay, 
we need to grab either one of these two. Well, that one's got a lot of military in it. Well, they all have actually. Yes, Majesty. Oof, that's expensive. Looks like Vernius is doing well on the old uh, hegemony. Must have captured a special region, I suspect. Sign me up. Coming up, Mona. Let's link you two. We are ready. You grab the spice. We are listening, Majesty. We that come scripts. Grab the ornithopter. Fifty. That's got to be the one to go for. Man, that's a Ready lot of defense, defense, actually. That is a lot of defense. For duty. We'll march you, know you do that, grab and we do back there. The go back here. I think I need another unit, honestly, to take down that. Such a, a lot of troops. Oh, there's loads of stuff to grab up here. Oh, another spice base. That's why we stick them on safe mode. Okay, we have enough, we just don't have enough troops. Get this next. 20% plus creep production. And that gives us plus 30 Solari as well. As an added bonus benefit. On watch. Flamers reporting. Reporting for duty. We'll march there. Yeah, one more incinerator, and then I think we'll go out and start capturing some land. At your service, your majesty. Okay, well I haven't got much influence, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to put 20 onto both of these. Which means we'll gain all the benefits. Granted the enemies will as well, but we need the authority production. And we need the money. Okay, they've all gone through, so everyone in, everyone benefits from that. Which is fine, honestly. I don't think I've won, I'd have won any of those if I didn't, so another needs must situation. We should wait for the other incinerator. That's, it's a challenging fight regardless. Oh, Vernius is flying in the lead. So we're lagging quite far. Ooh, is that well of riches? It is. Damn. Jesus, that's expensive. All right, well. Flame 
Stormtroopers are filled up. Come on Majesty. Reporting for duty. Let's get tab to par next. We're here to clean up the mess. We'll overwhelm them. Please no sandworm, please no sandworm. <laughs> See, that is five, isn't it? One, two, three, four, f six, even. Okay, we'll get a free starter car for killing all these then. Cheeky little bonus, I suppose. you to stop them from attacking. We are listening, Majesty. Following orders. Take as much damage as you can. It's an honor, Majesty. Following orders. Following orders. Coordinating the attack. Yeah, flame is too good. We serve the Imperium. Reporting for duty. Coordinating the attack. Beautiful. This would be a good one to grab as well. Got 156, man. So expensive. Harvester in working order. Starting to build a little bit of a surplus of manpower, but as soon as we capture this, it's all going to go to naught as we replan the boys. That should get a free side of car. I love Sardaukar. Probably my favourite um, sub-faction in all of uh, June. They're just so cool. Alright, build ourselves another refinery. Now we're already thought uh, I kind of want the extra 2% influence. Right, it's expensive, but I think it's uh, needs must. Oof. Okay, there we go. At least we've got uh, an extra two influence yes, coming in now. Majesty. I can use influence to uh, to buy stuff. Man, everything's so expensive. I really need well of riches. That would be awesome. I think I'm gonna have to drop a. Uh, base around here somewhere though. Let's make that more affordable. Kwao Nin looks like it'd be a good good spot for that. Listening. So we should grab some uh, knowledge. Also gives us manpower because of the village quirk. All clear. Let's grab some water. So that's a five region as well, which is good. Yes. Uh, you send. What do you thought over there? I think we want the Fremen. Interesting. Spice crew reporting. Okay. Listening, Majesty. So 
This would be a... I wonder if that's the better one to get, actually. We'll double check both of those and see which one we want to go for. But I suspect to be one of these. So this goes for research, which is pretty strong. This goes for water. It's only a two area, though. Or a two wind zone. So, yeah, I think Tismaval is the one to go for. It's also cheaper to buy. Expensive though. We assault the car as our Emperor commands. It's not be another incinerator. More manpower. Do you need some fire? We are listening, Majesty. At your service, Your Majesty. We are Sardaukar. No one compares to Sardaukar. We are ready. How can I help? Take that. We're here. We salute our Emperor. I wonder whether we build an airport here actually. Might be sensible. Elite of the Imperium at your service. Flamers reporting. Listening, Majesty. Moving. Operation Scorched Earth in progress. We are listening, Majesty. Reporting for duty. We have shot the car. Flamers reporting. As our Emperor commands. They don't stand a chance. You'd be careful and don't use the Sada car. We'll go there now. Consider it done. Okay, he's no longer taking damage. Great. Should be pretty straightforward from here. Right, Sada car do get the benefit they can actually execute when they're below a certain threshold or health threshold. Which you can later upgrade to uh, provide influence as well. <laughs> It's another reason why Sardaukar are awesome. Six point four, they are flying, Alvernius. Your Majesty. Do that and that. You know what? I'm going to put 50 on both of those. It'll probably end up going to me anyway. Ideal. Kind of wanted to be at peace with everyone because I gain loads of benefits from being at peace with everyone. But the extra manpower costs and. Building faction. Oh, plus we get plus 10 land strats, and now we get 300. Which is an extra 100 max influence plus 1 influence reduction charm buying price. Not that we need charm, but. Okay, we should get this valuable trinkets. Probably wonders of the desert. We need to start capturing um, special regions. Flame 
Leftovers are filled up. Capture all the good stuff. Right, let's start getting some mana. Okay, minus thirty percent upkeep cost, which is great. I can be a reliable ally. It's not bad. That is a good trade. But I do need money, so let's see if we can trade. do need to sort our influence um uh, not influence sorry what do you authority need? Good region, but it's so expensive. Um, I really do want Weller Riches. Well, we have got the three thousand gold. Okay, well that's not a question. drop then. I think Wow Nim would be really good. Ah. There's no room to build it. That's unfortunate. Um, well, old bats. That's surrounded some pretty good areas. Alright. Let's go with that. Hegemony a day. Oh, let's go for this one. Research center. What's the cost of this? 125. Yeah, I can work with that. That's much better. It was like 300 before. I think manpower is probably the next one we want. Time to sort out this um, economy of mine. Listening. Harvester in working order. Let's 
Okay, that's much cheaper as well. That one's pretty cheap too. Be short on oh no, we'll be alright for spice. It's gonna be all my spice though. Actually, even that one's cheaper, 218. Team two over there. Oh, what am I doing? I can just airdrop them. Remove all the risk. Absolutely no money. My support is not free. That's not too far away. No one compares to Sardaukar. What do you need, my emperor? Brawler on report. At your service, your majesty. Very cheap. This would be a good win for us. Man, hegemony, I'm actually really behind. I'll have to do something about Vernius, actually. Generally, might have stopped killing them off or something. Because they are powering. Doing the damage. We won't fail in our duty. Okay, well, at least this sorts out money problem. The fact that we can build the uh, the building twice is amazing. Okay, now we need military. Not concerned about money anymore. I think we've got loads coming in and we will have even more, so Spice Crew reporting. Yes. Ah, oh, Labathaptor. Okay, so how many regions? Six. Okay. One. Two. On vector. Three, On the four, move. Okay. Five. Six. Received. And Landstrad. Okay, let's grab this for more hegemony. Okay, we need to start using these crafts. Okay, that's the base we need to take. Right now though, 40 Solari. Grab some spice. Okay, none of this is good. I'm just going to oppose this one. Don't really care about the others. Lovely. What do you need, my emperor? Right, we need to really s turn on the gas. Now, as far as... Uh, Hegemony goes, and we might need to stop, actively start 
challenging our opponents as well. An 86, that's quite cheap. Elite of the Imperium at your service. Well, Van, yes, they're a problem. Oh, this is a special region, they can't be allowed to get that. Listening. Right. That's real bad. As our Emperor commands. I can be a reliable ally. Cost me 50. I don't have 50, I think. Mm, I, I can do it. My support is not. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Oh, can we get there in time? No. I don't think I can. I'm just gonna grab it. Ah, oh, that's a problem. All right, we need to sort this lot out. They're uh, they're a big problem. They're a big big problem. They are a big, big problem. Listening, Majesty. Yes, Majesty. Elite of the Imperium at your service. We assault the car. We salute our Emperor. That. Real shame they managed to take that. Oh, I'm running out of resources. Shoot. Real supplies, I should say. Liberate this village. At your service, Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Timing on that, not gonna lie. Reporting for duty. Following orders. Yes, Majesty. We are sorting out the new team one. One five seven. What do you need, my Emperor? No one compares to Sartaka. Okay, water is definitely a problem. We should deal with that. Some 
this is a five zone so that's a good one for dew collectors Ralph's workshop next. Curious how this works, and then we actually turn this back to neutrality. Oh, they lose influence or hegemony. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. So we could potentially start targeting their... Um... This is costing us. We're going to lose all our troops if we ain't careful. We've got no supplies. Okay, that's good. So we can at least slow them down. What's Why has Harkonnen got more... Must have just captured a special region themselves. Ah, uh, damn Dak, I presume. What's the cost of this? This is a cheap one. We grab that. I think there'll be enough. What do you need, my emperor? This as well. Okay, what's the next thing we could target? We could take this from them. That'd be a good one. I've just got no supplies all the time. The water's killing me. That sandstorm really doesn't help. <laughs> yes, oh, I love the radio static. That's so cool. That is a really cool thing. <laughs> Right, that pushes us in the lead. All we need to do is hold, stop them from expanding. Kinda. We salute our emperor. <sighs> this one would be worth picking up. 226. <laughs> expensive. Very expensive. Okay, we only got one of those. Get some supplies. Okay, so in my experience, Wanisha is actually the better one, purely because of the ability to heal all conscript swordsmen and riflemen at long range, or fifty percent of their max health. Um, does cost them at a ma manpower as it would to heal them at village, but it's a really powerful tool. Um, and this guy is more about the Sardaukar, um, but I'm going to go with Wanisha. I mean, they're both good. There's no, uh, there's no two ways about that. Okay, so we've captured this. So let's start building crafts buildings. No one to we'll go there now. Okay, money for that worth. What do you need? We're here. On it. Okay, let's get the Fremen just to pick stuff up. Order. Free up some money. Oh man, we're actually killing it with money now. Okay, 
Mm, none of that's actually very good. Just oppose that. I'm all going into military now anyway, so it doesn't really bother me the fact that that's happened. 243, that is probably the next one we want. And that should secure the game for us. I can be a reliable ally. Yeah, I'll take money. Money's the one thing I need. Yes. Listening. What do you need, my emperor? No one compares to Sartakar. I wonder if we try and, uh,. Where's the worms? Uh, let's try. Uh, let's go parallel training. Imperial protocols. Modular parts, I guess. Wait, what? Interesting. To be fair, it looks like the um, scavenger's done a pretty good job of pushing everyone back. Like the other two enemies. This is a special region. We definitely want to capture this, but still just haven't got enough... Authority. Well, look at that. 132. Woof. Because so they're actually capturing this village. That's really good for us. Especially as they're a sub house. Well, they're not really a sub house, but they're not really competing at the moment. Okay, I'm getting the most hegemony per tick, though, which is good. We grab that and we should be golden. Oh, it's gone up to 316. Vernius's tropism. Owned villages. Oh, is that the thing he stopped me from grabbing? Research wise. Well. That's rude. Spice crew reporting. Maybe we just go for little bases rather than big ones. Like we could grab this 129. Ugh. Is that going to be enough though? I'm just concerned we don't have enough time to grab a big base like that. Just because of the cost. And interestingly, Harkonnen are the ones that are. Making this as close as it is. We should just grab this. We haven't got enough time to capture this base. Fifty nine. 
Yeah, this should give us enough. Hopefully that will take some hegemony off of them and they lose that base. In theory. Twelve point six now, eleven point nine. Yeah, nice. Listening, Majesty. Yeah, that should be all she wrote. I think. Pretty sure that will give us about a thousand. I think. Should be getting enough hegemony from all the uh, special regions. Can I help you, Father? I'd like to do more for the family. The tigers will take care of it. We are listening, Majesty. All clear. What do you need, my Emperor? As long as no one takes a special region, we're golden. By no one, I mean Vernius and um, Harkonnen. Elite of the Imperium at your service. 13.8, not 75. I could just capture one more base, I think it would secure, but just don't have enough um No one compares to Sartakar. Yeah, we just don't have enough uh authority. Still, I'm pretty sure we're um, going to win this anyway. We're here to clean up the mess. Listening. Reporting. So they're going to grab that base. What do you need, my emperor? Do I really need to start attacking them? I don't know. So quite a ways away from victory. This one I could probably grab. Seems to be the cheapest base on the map that's left. Yeah, they're only 12k, so even when we grab this, I mean, most is going to go up to his 13. 12.6. Yeah, we got this in the bag. They'd have to capture like three or four territories. And there's no way they're banking that much authority, not on this difficulty level. They'll be spending it as soon as they got it. Yeah, yeah. Nice, 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 nice. This is the only region I need to keep an eye on, basically, to make sure no one's capping that.
Again, this is the benefit of being able to do build two um, two craft workshops per special region. It means you can gain hegemony faster than anyone else. <laughs> Such a specialist um, ability to be able to build multiple buildings of the same type. None of that is very good, to be honest. We salute our emperor. Okay, 145 was it? 147. No one compares to Let's do it, let's nab it. That might be enough just to take it over. For water, sure, why not? We have sought the guard. They don't stand a chance. Flamethrowers are filled. Never know why I hit him. You should be GG's. I'm fairly certain that should be enough. We're listening. We'll get them. We are ready. Oh, the Imperial base also adding some DPS. Nice. It's an Let's not lose any units unnecessarily. Yes, Majesty. Lovely jovely. That should be all she wrote. Already been taken, and this one's way out of reach. Wow. Now, this base again. To clean up the mess. Reporting for duty. Flamers reporting. No one compares to Sartakar. Actually, you know what? Maybe we don't even need to Majesty. take that risk. We are ready. Majesty. This territory is yours. Well, that was to the point. <laughs> Damn straight, it's mine. All your base are belong to me. Well, we were slow to uh, gain knowledge, weren't we? I really went heavy on the... Um, On the research. We had lots of money. <laughs> lots of money. And we were raking it in, but even then it was like Vernius was absolutely raking it in. It was 580 per tick. Wow. I mean, we were 210 and we were making bank but my god good job this wasn't a charm shares victory <laughs> that'd have been challenging yeah we did well with landstrad and we had a good military as well interestingly uh the scavengers had a big military, and they were using it to uh, to smash Harkonnen. And I think they kept um, Vernius at bay as well, to be fair. I mean, they did a lot of the work for us. Noise. Alrighty, folks, well, that'll right about do it for the first episode in this series. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.